Shagadine Agasse V Joey Holdenling Ach uh, <laughs> Da Joey it does the scribble all the stick in the does the lads over yeah. Joey congratulations Joey your sense uh, after that uh, titanic tussle there today yeah, a massive game, you know, we knew coming into it, it was, it was a big build-up when you're break from Christmas and that, so we knew we were massive. You see what Ballygun are doing in Waterford, they're beating teams well at some stages, so they're a massive team, so massive credit to them, I think it's a great game for the crowd. Maybe low scoring in some stages, but the conditions kind of allow for that, I suppose. Thank God for the, I suppose, the muck and the goal there at one stage for us, but that's the way it goes. You need them breaks some of the time, but a massive game, so we're just delighted to get over the, over the line. It was like a chess game in the first half, nothing at all in it, and the goal effort then that Ballygunner had that you referenced, where the ball got stuck, it came off somebody's leg, I'm not sure whether it was yours or somebody else, but you did enough. Two minutes later, Owen Cody had the ball in the other net. I mean, small things can turn games, can't they? That's it, small things turn games. You see that in last year's senior hurling championship, small things, but listen, we got the small things today, another thing that could have went in the goal, but I suppose if the muck wasn't there, I might have cleared it out. So they're all small things there, nip and tuck in these sort of games, but we're lucky to come out on the right side of it, you know. Oh, Cody, like what a finish out of him, you know. We told him, look in the keeper's eyes and bury it, and that's what he went in. He could have took that shot from another 10 yards out maybe a few weeks ago, but he ran in and made sure he finished it, so fair play to him. You're one of the, I think, five starters from the 2015 All-Ireland Final. There were a load of new fellas have come on stream. I think Henry was saying five fellas had never played an All-Ireland semi-final who came in and started for you today. I want you to just describe for me what you thought of their impact because it was pretty impressive. Well, I suppose we, we, we see him up the whole way along. They've won 221s. We can see their impact. Adrian Mullen, fantastic. Connor Phelan came, came on there, driving lads on. Joey Cuddy came on, as well as the lads starting. Darren Mullen, who's... Unbelievable in the under-21 county final and he's putting it out in the senior field now. So Evan Shefflin, savage striking the ball, but it's their heart and their determination that makes them a bit special and that's what we need on this team to drive us out, lads, on because well, some of us are getting a bit old, but um, them lads just bring, it, that bring that youth, that bring that drive and we want to win for them more so than they want to win for us. And the Henry Shefflin impact at half-time in the dressing room? Ah, massive, yeah. You know, you just listen to him. That's, that's all you can say, just listen to what he says, take in what he says, he's been here. He's won many games in Turles, he's pulled, maybe lost a few, so he has that experience and you could hear him in, 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 during the first half alone, alone at half time, driving us on and telling us, get up on our men and all that wise words, all you have to do is listen to that man and he will drive you on. All right, we'll go further, uh, you are through to the All-Ireland in five weeks' time. Fantastic news for Ballyhale Shamrocks, so because her count, AIB, thought Jason Dempsey and Sola Gradham Leach, Nehemiah Avrona, er Joey Holden. Go further, Joey.